Well, good morning. Yes, we're on the road. We're headed to um, Connersville, Indiana to ride on the Whitewater Valley Railroad. And I am really pumped about this. We bought this trip uh, at an auction for a fundraiser for Child Care Choices. And uh, we've set on it ever since, but we only have till the end of October to use it. So we figured we better go check it out. If we really like it, we may go back when the foliage change occurs to get some pictures, but we figured we could scope it out today. It's supposed to be a quite a warm day, mid 80s at the high, maybe 83 to 85 and humid. So we'll do that today and uh, that will be the video today. So I'm taking you along and I'll be sharing this uh, in a post probably tomorrow morning. So hang on tight, here we go. Okay, a really funny story. This guy is standing here when Teresa's got her camera. She points at him, takes his picture, he walks over, says, ma'am, did you just shoot me? And she says, yes, you're dead. And he chuckled and says, well, I die several times today. Part of their act, it was so funny. Oh, I don't 
Don't mind the new kid walk on my seven hole. With somebody rough rolling, run with a bird and put full iron on a three mile break. It was on that way that he lost his airbrake. You see what a jump that he made. Oh boy. Well, a telegram came to Washington Station, and this is how it read. Oh, that brave engineer that is Roll 97 is lying down in Danville, dead. Oh, boy. He was going down the grave, making 90 mile an hour when his whistle broke into a stream. He was found in the wreck with his hand on the rock hole and scalded to death by the sea. So come all you pretty ladies, you must take warning from this time on, you must learn. Never speak hard words to your true love and husband, he may leave you and never return. train station. We're on our way home. Teresa's driving and I wanted to record a few thoughts real quick while I thought about it, while I'm thinking about it. So first of all, really cool. I uh, really enjoyed the ride, the, the acting, if you want to call it that. They have these volunteers that dress up as uh, good guys and bad guys and they put on a performance. We didn't get to see the whole performance at the little town we stopped at but when they on the way back they stopped at the stop and they all got out and put on a show right outside the window and uh, it was quite nice and uh, a lot of fun and worth the time so they go the train ride is about an hour long hour a little over an hour and 20 minutes hour 10 minutes I don't know it is over an hour but less than two and um, the, you spend two hours at this little town, and it's just a good time. So I'm going to put a link to this in the... Uh, it's a, they, they have more than this particular train ride. This one's coming to an end. It's only got one more month. It's the third Saturday and Sunday of next month, and then it comes to an end and is done. Let me 
straighten out here. But um, but it's worth it if you got some time and you want to get over here. It'll probably be a little cooler. It was definitely hot today. It started out really cool because we had all that fog. But uh, after lunch, on the ride down, it got hot. And by the time we came back, those 10 cans with no air conditioning were really hot. So it was, it was quite warm. Uh, the other comment I'll make is, is that they have a Christmas special thing they do where they, they do an activity that I'm sure would be great for kids. They take a train during November. They drive the train down through there. They have some spots where they have Christmas decorations, and Santa stuff, and all kinds of things. It sounds really interesting. If we had young kids, we'd definitely be interested. I think my grandkids would enjoy it. So we'll see. Um, so that's it. This will be a wrap. And hope you enjoy it remember I'll put the link to their website in the comments below and you'll be able to read that and catch up on the, that information um, if you like the video be sure you click like below down here and if you really like it and you want more like it subscribe on YouTube so that you get notified when I post new content and uh, the, the next few days I got a family issue I may be helping with so my plan is to post this on Sunday morning and then try to get a post out Tuesday or Wednesday and then post again next week on Thursday or Friday and uh, I need a little flexibility this week because of some family things we're working on so uh, normally I would post on uh, Sunday Tuesday Tuesday would be the day but Tuesday may be tough I'll let you know as soon as I get through uh, tomorrow have a great one. Stay cool wherever you're at and enjoy.